forecast starts now with meteorologist Dan Tomasso. Uh, all eyes on the long weekend here coming up and a lot of this weather will likely extend into the weekend in terms of sunshine clearing conditions, but we do have to track some showers and storms as is par for the course this time of the year. And right now I am getting some of this haze in our picture here from Marysville. Remember this camera is about a thousand feet up so you can see over top of the city of Harrisburg. And again, when we get kind of a stagnant, slow moving weather pattern, we get some of that air pollution and haze kind of sitting over the horizon. Here's Hershey right now. Looks like a wasp or a yellow jacket has visited the camera there, but a nice day across the board there in parts of Southern Dolphin County. How about Doppler radar? There's not much going on, but a little bit more activity than even this past weekend provided some showers and storms off to the west and southwest kind of rounding over the ridges here and trying to work their way eastward. But I will say there has not been much activity locally. McConnellsburg had a brief shower in Fulton County, Western Franklin County as well, and now a thunderstorm developed south of Hagerstown. But if you are northeast of South Mountain, I really think there will not be much in the way of activity today. Current temperatures out there low to mid 80s, but as warm as 88 in Carlisle, that maintains the highest number so far we've reached today. Winds coming out of the west or even southwest at times, but pretty variable. There's not much of a breeze throughout the course of the day today. That will change by the end of the week. As the weather pattern begins to shift to another area of high pressure, I do think we'll get more of a breeze Thursday and Friday, but this is a nice one out there. Temperatures in the middle to upper 80s. Some places will likely hit 90 degrees, but there's a lot of H's on this map because there is not much going on. Big ridge of heat and really a heat wave over parts of the central United States still trying to edge its way eastward. Some showers on the northern and western side of the high. That's what we're tracking here for the next couple of days. But in the meantime, again, some passing clouds mainly dry today. We're clear tonight through the start of tomorrow. But notice as we head into the afternoon, there may be a brief shower or thunderstorm. I think this is a little bit overdone, but there will be storms to our north and they could drift in our direction late tomorrow. Again, that could happen on Wednesday too. But in the meantime, there is not much of a chance of rain until the next front gets here, and I think that's Friday into Saturday, Valerie. But with any luck, again, neither day's a washout Friday and Saturday. These are thunderstorms passing through. Mm -hmm. Then Sunday should be a gorgeous day, less humid, mostly sunny, and that could trend into the start of early next week. So if you are trying to plan for Labor Day, right. Sunday and Monday looking really nice at this point. Saturday, there will be some storms to track. Could use some rain, though. We could use some <laughs> rain. Starting to get a little dry again. All right. Thank you. We'll be right back.